हाय आर यू ए क्रिएटिव पर्सन डू यू लाइक टू स्केच डू यू लाइक टू डिजाइन न्यू थिंग्स डू यू लाइक टू थिंक आउट ऑफ द बॉक्स आर यू अ इनोवेटिव बटरफ्लाई rather than being a bookish worm then this video is just for you my friend if you want to pursue a career in design and technology then there are many different colleges in india where you can apply and one of the best colleges is srishti manipal institute of art design and technology i applied in this college around 3 years ago and i am now in third year so i have good amount of experience knowledge about this college if you haven't checked our latest video on this channel uh, which was interim program then you should check it i saw that there are many comments where people wants to know more about this college that's why i thought of making this video srishti is a constituent unit of manipal so manipal if you know is a really renowned private college in india and it have different degrees you can say engineering law and medical sciences different i guess it have taken every field inside it but it didn't have design as a course but now because srishti is a constituent unit uh, then it has design also many people wants to know how to get into this college so if i talk about entrance test it is called smeat which means srishti manipal entrance and aptitude test smiadt is the name of the college which is srishti manipal institute of art design and technology so if i talk about the test which is aptitude test so as you all know that aptitude is a natural ability to do something do you have an aptitude for creative thinking or drawing or painting or design then definitely you should consider this college and you should consider giving the exam for it i will tell you what courses the college provide you what is the process of admission what exam structure is there now let's talk about what courses sisti provides you so there are different courses if you want to do bachelor's degree then there are bachelor of design b des bachelor of vocational arts which is b voc bfa bachelor of fine arts if you want to do a full degree course then it is bachelor of design which is four years course and if you want to do the bachelor of vocational course then it is three years course now if you want to do a master's degree and then they, there is masters of design if you want to do phd then there are also doctoral programs in srishti if i just talk about the bachelor's degree and in bachelor's in particular bachelor of design degree then there are different courses like vcsb iadp iidp creative and applied computation human centered design hcd the creative education industrial arts and design practices which is iadp and then public space design if you want to go for interior design or something like that then public space design is there now these are the courses of bds <coughs> if i talk about bfa which is bachelor of fine arts then they have different courses like film digital media arts contemporary art practices creative writing in mds in masters also similar courses are there the name is a bit different in srishti you don't have fashion design but you have textile design bdes which is bachelor of design is 4 years course and the bvoc is just 3 years of course the bvoc is a skill based vocational program now i am going to talk about the admission process so the admission process is very simple but it might be complicated for you because first you have to go to the official website of the srishti manipal institute on the srishti institute website you will apply for the exam 
you will have to verify your documents you will have to check whether you are eligible for the exam or not you will get the dates for the exam and then you will go and you will give the exam and if you are lucky and you are skilled definitely i would say skilled then they will choose you and they will call you uh, for the further process once you get your results you will be selected and you will be given the admission letter so initially they will just charge uh, i guess initial fees from you once you uh, get your results if you want to go for the course after submitting that fees you will have to completely pay the whole year fees to them which is different for different courses if i talk about the entrance exam of srishti then the structure is like that they organize the entire entrance exam thing in three rounds so the first round is called r1 the second round is r2 the third round is r3 around in feb they organize the round 1 of the entrance exam they organize it in delhi mumbai pune bangalore hyderabad kolkata chennai kochi jaipur ahmedabad guwahati dubai even in dubai they organize it kolala lampur and colombo because manipal have uh, its unit in dubai also don't think that round is similar to the test you can either choose to apply for the first round or the second round or the third round they will allocate some seats in the first round some in the second round and if in the first and second round if there are some seats remaining they will allocate it to the round 3 you can apply for any one of them say we have applied in round 1 or let's say we have applied in round 2 it doesn't matter it doesn't actually matter because both of the round structure is similar in each round there are two tests in the morning from 9 am to 10:30 am you will have to be inside the exam hall the test one is about the general ability it is called gta general test of ability what do i mean when i say like general it is general for all because whether you have applied for any course in the in the college all of you will get the similar exam pattern similar paper in the test one so the time period for both these papers will be 90 minutes and test one and test two both of these will carry 50 marks each <laughs> the test two is called tbt or cbt theme based or context based test so let's say you have applied for the vcsb course for the entrance test then in test 1 you will get the similar paper which the other courses students have got but in the test 2 they will specifically design the paper for your own course they will judge your ability that whether you have the ability to pursue that course or not so in that paper in the second test they will give you questions related to your course test one will be from 9 am to 10 am <laughs> then you will have a half an hour break then from 11 to 12 30 pm you will be given the test two within this period your test will be done this is the general structure which sisti follows every year let me just make it clear to you that i am not even promoting my college i am just guiding you if your needs and your skills meet with what this college provides you then only you should consider applying for this college if you have a good financial background good family which supports you and if you are really really passionate about design then only you should consider this college otherwise first thing is that you won't get into the college through the entrance exam if you don't have the passion for it even if you get into it you will end up just wasting your money and time thank you so much for watching if you like the video please like it and do subscribe it will help me grow i wish you all the best with this i end this video i hope you liked it keep shining keep hustling